explaining what I do to an outsider, I would say that the supervisory board is one of three governance bodies for EIT Health. There's the partner assembly, the supervisory board, and the strategic management team. And the main role of the supervisory board is to supervise the management team. Now, my role as the chairwoman of the supervisory board is to make sure that we're discussing the right topics to ensure that we're effectively doing that. How does EIT help startups? Wow. An easier question might be, is there any area in which startups are not supported? Honestly, I could go on forever about this. Perhaps it's better for me to suggest a visit to the EIT Health website. On the homepage, navigate to the What We Do category, and you can select to filter our programs by subcategory, Startups. There you will see descriptions of the many programs that support startups from developing entrepreneurial skills, to the creation of a startup, to the scale up of a startup, to commercial success. Check out, as an example, the Venture Center of Excellence, Gold Track, Wildcard, and Bridgehead, just to name a few of our programs. All of them leverage our extensive networks of health partners, as well as coordination with other EU programs in this area. You know, the outcome I'm most hoping for, for the Innovate Paris event, is that as, as a result of over 600 participants attending, meeting with colleagues and building stronger networks, we'll enhance the sustainability of pan-European health systems. This in turn will better prepare us to anticipate and hopefully avoid the worst consequences of public healthcare threats that we seem to be facing with increasing frequency.